So I am shooting in 1080p with my Canon SX280 <laughs> HS. I don't I don't remember the letters. Yeah, A B C D one two three whatever. But it is a new camera and it looks really good right now. I don't know if you guys can tell. You guys can probably tell from the flip cam footage to this. It's like phenomenal. Me and my mom are about to watch Polar Express. That's another good Christmas movie. I want to see Jingle All the Way. Wait, wait, what I have on? You can wear it whenever you want. Mm -mm, too nice. So me and my mom watched the Polar Express. She had never seen the Polar Express the who? before. The Polar Express. What's the Polar Express? The movie. People don't know that. You have to explain it. They know. You the, said me and my mom and brother. Ain't nobody know what you even said. Take two. Okay. But me and my mom watched the movie, The Polar Express, yesterday. She, that was her first time ever seeing it. That was pretty good. Yeah, it was really good. Did you? What did you say? That was like maybe top, top five Christmas movies of yeah, all time. Yeah, that was a really good Christmas movie. Yeah, yeah. Yep, I agree. Yeah, and it was made in two thousand and four, and the animation on it was so so good. I didn't even realize how advanced it was back then when I did see it. Awesome. When two thousand four, I was nine years old, so I was in the fourth grade. I was in the fourth grade when I saw it. me and my um. My school went to go see it uh, on a field trip, and that was actually the first ever field trip that my mom didn't go with me on. She always chaperoned, and I was begging her. I, I used to beg you, right? Like, you please, can I go I by myself? You know why I had to chaperone? Because Jawan was so bad in school, if I didn't chaperone, they wouldn't let him go. So, there. Oh, for real? They didn't... <laughs> they, didn't they wouldn't let... Oh, my... Yeah, I, I, was, I, was, I was a handful when I was in elementary school and middle it school. It was horrible. It wasn't until high school that I just like... No, high school too. High school? Probably like his 11th grade, sophomore year, he started to get it. Yeah, Literally. okay, all right, all right. Sophomore when year, that's when I started to chill. And that's not 11th grade, that's 10th grade. When I get back later on, when um, maybe later on tonight, I'm gonna show you how Jawan used to act when he was in pre-K. Wait, how are you like, gonna I used them? to go pick him up from school and all the kids used to be online like this. Yeah. Coming out, and I'd be so excited to see him, and I'd be looking for him. Where's my baby? Where's my baby? Then I see this kid coming out. The teacher have him like this. <laughs> his ties off, pants open, walking on his shoes. <laughs> Wait. My, dirty shirt. My looking pants crazy, open. like just like looking low up in the sky. And all the other children were so nice, walking with their hands on their hand, on their mouth like this. Except for my kid, he had to be grabbed like this by the teacher. He's looking all over. She's dragging him. His shirt is open. Pants all jacked up. <laughs> shoes messed up. Juice on his shirt. Looking like a loon. Look, that was that was pre-K. I was four years old. It's okay. The other okay. kids are doing that. Well, yeah, uh, that's <laughs> the beginning of the end. Right here. Well, look how it turned out now. To be continued. <laughs> If you guys have seen my previous vlogs, every time I put this song on, it's called Fireworks by Katy Perry. This is like our song when we're driving and we want to have fun. We put this song on and she usually goes crazy and I usually go crazy and usually sing. But uh, today I think she knew that I had the camera on. Yeah. 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 Finally. <laughs> so I finally found the one flaw in this camera. It has awesome... HD quality video, but at the same time the battery dies so fast and luckily my mom bought me two batteries Like I, obviously the battery that comes with the camera and then she also bought me a backup battery I don't know if she knew that or if someone told her but Good thing she got that for me for Christmas because I've been switching batteries every time almost like every You know three times I have to turn on the camera so I'm gonna see if maybe I can get like one of those lithium batteries. I don't know if they have the lithium batteries for the cameras that like almost look like microchips. I'm gonna check that out. Today's New Year's Eve and a lot of people like on my Instagram and on Facebook and on Twitter, a lot of people are saying, oh, 2013, I'm so glad that this year's behind me. And it seems like every year people say that, like, oh, I'm so glad 2012 is behind me. I'm so glad 2011 was behind me. It was the worst year. And this year is going to be way better. But it's just like a, a cycle. Every year, 
they say the same thing. But I don't think that they're really trying. I think that everyone gets so souped up about the new year, the whole, you know, happy new year kind of thing. And they set goals for themselves, but they never, ever, or well, not never, but they hardly get the chance to fulfill those goals. And that's why I'm not a big believer in New Year's resolutions. Like, I don't want to just pick that this one moment to try to better myself. I think that you can try to make, you know, personal goals whenever you want to. If I was to pick a New Year's resolution, it would probably be to get in better shape. I am in good shape. I'm a 19 year old and I'm an athlete. I'm in really good shape, but I want to get bigger as far as like, you know, muscles go. Cause I'm a skinny dude. If you guys have seen like shots that are not just my face, like when, during Christmas and stuff like that, I'm, I'm a pretty skinny dude and I'm, I want to change that. All right, so let's see if I can do that. But I do hope you guys have a great new year and I hope that you guys set those goals and you guys fulfill them and you guys go through with them because it's no, nothing better than bettering yourself. Like I said, I hope you guys have a great new year and love you guys. Bye. World's best mom. That's me. Holla. No, you did not just say that.